going on today guys? Tomcat here and today I'm bringing you guys some more spin tires. Now in my last uh, spin tires video I did the um, Ram 3500 versus the F450 and the uh, the GMC 6x6. However at the end I was supposed to try out the the more power version the, the more powerful version of the Ram 3500 but I ended up at the last second I ended up choosing the wrong version and I didn't even notice it and a bunch of you guys mentioned that to me in the comments below so um, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the actual high-powered version. I've driven it a little bit, and um, it's a bit crazy. But uh, but don't worry, I do have some more stuff uh, actually in store uh, in the rest of this video. I'm not going to do just a video uh, for this um, for just the higher-powered version of this single truck. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and launch it. And as you can see, it gets off the line immediately. Uh, no waiting whatsoever. Whatsoever. It gets off the line immediately. Now increase in power from an already powerful truck means that this is going to jump around a little bit. It, it's it's kind of something that you just have to get used to and something that you're not really going to be able to get rid of, I guess you could say. But, I mean, the power, though, is is going into a tree. No, the power is um, insane, though, on this, uh, on this even more powerful version. I'll show you guys in just a second how insane this power is once I actually get to the top of this hill. Um, and there's no... As you guys can see, no wheel spin whatsoever, no trouble get actually getting to the top of this particular hill. Let's see if we can actually get up there. Yeah, there we go. And even when it gets super steep, no problem. No problem. It just it just goes. And this is even, like I said, more powerful than the uh, than the standard one. And it pretty much it can go through trees, basically. Uh, there's nothing that can stand in this truck's way. Like, look at it, watch. Oh god, time's changing time's changing you know what just to prevent that from freezing again I'm gonna just pause I'm just gonna pause it but yeah once you actually hit the gas in this thing it, it might as well climb trees because it's powerful enough to completely just take them out as you can, and as you can see like I said nothing is really able to get in this truck's way it'll crawl over pretty much any rocks um, that you go that you run into and it'll go through the trees that you run into. So there's kind of uh, there's kind of nothing really that can that can stop this truck. In fact, I've got an idea. I've got an idea. I went up the river actually in my last uh, in the regular version of this truck, or at least the version with Kamaz wheels. Um, this version has the uh, the regular wheels and tires. However, it has a ton more power. So let's actually see what it can do when it goes like literally just goes up the river. So get in high. See what we can do. Completely underwater, but it doesn't really even care. Just, just full on powering it. Not even phased. Let's actually see. Let's try and climb up the right side this time. I climbed to the left last time. Let's see if we can do the right side. Without flipping. Whoa, my God. Holy crap, that was a little bit crazy. But we actually ended up back on our wheels again. That was insane. And we just barreled through these, these trees here while doing a wheelie. Uh, while, while doing a wheelie and climbing up the bank and landing back on the road. So, as you guys can see, this thing is a bit uh, insane. Um, it's a bit insane. And you guys should definitely uh, definitely uh, check out the high-powered version if, you're, uh, if you guys want to have a truck in, the, in spin tires that's basically able to, I need to stop saying basically, uh, but able to go through anything it wants. But we've still got it in high, and I'm just going to try something real quick. No problem. No problem. It's basically a giant bulldozer is what this thing is. You can go literally anywhere on the map because you don't even have to use the roads. You barrel through the trees in this thing. And there's the edge of the map. There's the edge of the map. And we've gone all that way just straight through the woods there's nothing there was nothing to get in our way absolutely nothing now I have something else to move on to actually though in this video I have another truck that I want to show you guys and it is this Freightliner now this is definitely not a truck that you would imagine to see in spin tires it's definitely not a practical truck for spin tires you could say but there are some really cool things that you can actually do with this truck as I will show you in just a second, if I can, there we go, the parking brake on, uh, now let's see, 
This truck actually came with two trailers, and if I can find them, I think they're further down the list. Let's see, here we go. They got a log trailer and a refrigerator trailer. Now, I'll show you the log trailer because it's not the same kind of log trailer that you got on the, uh, the Kraz. Because it is one giant tree trunk. That is all that that thing is. It's one giant tree trunk, as you guys can see. Uh, it's crazy huge and very, very, very heavy. So, I'm going to see if we can hitch up to it and actually get it turned around. Um, and then actually pull it out of here. Just get lined up real quick. Spin tires, trucking simulator. T to attach the trailer, there we go. Now let's see if we can actually get this thing turned around. God, that's huge. And when you're driving this, you can literally, you can feel, uh, the immense weight back there. It's insane. Trying to make sure I don't jackknife the truck. And also trying to make sure I don't run into that uh, that MAZ over there. Because if you do run into it, you'll get caught on it. Ooh, ooh, I don't know. Oh, God. We'll probably get caught on this. No, we made it. Oh, no, well, we got caught a little bit, but we made it pretty much. I don't have all-wheel drive on yet, but even now, you can tell it's it's... It's having to work. It really is having to work. And that tree trunk is honestly, it's actually bigger than the cab. It's, whoa, trailer disappeared for a second. Literally just glitched out, disappeared for a second. Actually, earlier on, when I was, um, when I was spawning the, uh, the ram and I had spawned in this with the trailer attached and, uh, and the ram as well. And when I ch switched over to the ram, the trailer on this truck disappeared. It just, just flat out disappeared. So, it's got a couple glitches to it, but then again, it's a mod, and you kind of have to be, you kind of have to be prepared for that, to be honest, when you download a mod. You can't expect it to be, like, polished and perfect. Now, this is the real test. Can we make it? Whoa, we're glitching a little bit. Lock the diff, maybe? Oh, jeez. That trailer's gonna be the hard part, though. God, it's so long. Oh, this is not working out. Come on, that's full power. Can we get it out? Oh, it's coming, it's coming. Oh, that wheel's glitchy. That wheel's glitchy. Real glitchy. I mean, we made it, but that that uh, those front tires are freaking glitchy. Really glitchy. I wonder if we take this dirt road up here. In fact, no. We're not going to take the dirt road. We're going to cross. We're not going to take the dirt road to the left. We're going to cross the river. Which might be a extremely stupid idea, but we're gonna do it anyway. The first thing you have to actually do is go through the mud, which might actually pose a big problem for this trailer. Never taken one of these through water before, so we'll see what happens. I mean, it's pulling. It's it's going slow, but it's pulling. Definitely, uh, definitely so heavy that it doesn't even get phased by the tide whatsoever. Unlike that GMC 6x6 for some re for some reason. But yeah, no, pulling, pulling up the hill really strong. I think I'll make it my mission to transport this to the other side of the map. So, we'll have kind of a mini delivery mission. Switch back to the front camera so I can actually see where I'm going. And this desert area is basically the other side of the map. But I don't want to end it off that quick. I want to actually have a, uh, a destination to bring it to. Which I do have in mind. If we can bring it around this corner. There you go. Nearly there. There might be a little bit of mud on this road. I'm not sure. Um, leading to the destination. There might be some mud. I know there's some uh, minor hills. But, um, but there may be some mud as well. And actually, I'm starting to have an idea. I'm starting to have an idea. I'm starting to think like, whoa! Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, it's there again. It glitched. It glitched. I'm starting to have an idea about whether or not I should go ahead and take it down that side road or not. As you guys can see, right, yeah, to the left. I was trying to spin the camera around. Right there, right there. 
You know what? Yeah, I'm gonna go on that and see how far I can get until I just either get stuck or the truck is, just dies. Trailer might get caught in the trees, but we're gonna try to pull it through anyway. Oh, no, 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 no. There we go. Come on. Come on. Really? Dang, we can't even reverse out. I've got the diff lock on and everything. This may end up being... No, 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 no. I was about to say it may end up being over before it even starts, but... It looks like it might It might be a little different. Oh, that's leaning. That's leaning majorly. Leaning uncomfortably. Alright, give me some power. Come on. There you go. Come on, come on. That glitched again. It glitches in that certain camera view. Ooh, okay. I need to be focusing forward. Because I w almost went the complete wrong way. I'm gonna have to be really careful because these corners are really damn tight. Crazy. Ugh. Oh, God. That's scaring me. Oh, this corner is going to be... Yeah, I, I don't know. I don't know if this corner is going to be manageable or not. Ah, oh, the trailer's caught on a tree. No, no, God, maybe, but in an extremely scary way, because we are literally balanced on one side right now. Oh, jeez. Just try to be slow and easy with this. Oh, come on, power! Come on, don't give up, don't give up, don't give up. Yes! There we go. Well, oh, if we make it through this road of this thing, that's going to be crazy. But, I don't know. I don't know if we will or not. Uh, oh, no. We can't back up any further. Oh, God. Look at that glitch on the front wheel. Ugh, that's some glitch. That's, that, that's like a pretty major glitch, actually. Come on. Oh, there's hope for this yet. Full power, that's all we can do right now is full power. It's doing it, it's doing it. Made it so far. Yeah, this is weird. The trailer glitches out every once in a while. It, this mod, like I said, is a bit unstable, you could say. Oh, this corner is going to be tricky. Give me some power, come on. Well, oh, that's not working. That's not working. Yes. Yes. Dang it. Almost got it. Almost got it. So close. So close. Yes. We made it. Now all we have to do is get down this little hill. Which may be harder than it looks because I don't want to flip this thing. Try and pull it through the trees. I don't even care. Dang, I am I am really impressed with that. I did not think it was gonna be able to make it through that without bogging down or getting caught on a tree or something, but it just powered its way through. It really, really did. And it and it impressed me. It honestly did impress me. That was a little scary. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, this could be terrible. No, wait, I think we're okay. Let me try to put it in high. Keep the diff lock on so we can keep pulling. Oh, my God. It's actually pulling it from the center of the trailer. 
There we go. Oh no. No, 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 no. Do not get caught in the rocks. And this is where I originally planned on going in the first place. So um, we took a little bit of a detour on the way, but nonetheless, we actually made it where we, uh, where we planned on going. And uh, that's, that's actually really impressive. I'm quite impressed with this mod, um, despite the fact that it's... What the heck? Trailer came off. I set the brake and the trailer came off. No idea what the heck was up with that. But um, if you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to leave me a like. Tell me in the comment section below what you thought of it. And if you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe for more. And I will see you guys in the next one. And don't forget, mod links will be in the description box below. Um, and if I can manage to find where I actually fa got this Freightliner, I can't remember if it was from, um, from the UV forums or from uh, spintires.nl. Uh, but I'll definitely find it. I'll try and find it for you guys. And um, again, hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys later.